What's up YouTube? Back for another video. Today we are going to do an unboxing and I'm going to take you through an arm day. Okay guys, welcome to the shortest commentary of your life. Um, today was arm day, you know, for arms right now. I'm not doing a ton of exercises, really just keeping it simple. Um, starting here with a preacher curl. Usually I'll do an easy bar, but I really like this machine. So I started with this and then I did four warm up sets with practically no weight. And then I got into four working sets. And now you see me here doing the standing dumbbell curls. Um, you see Joanne on her phone right next to me. Um, for these, I really just did four working sets. And for all of these exercises on arm day, I'm shooting for 14 to 18 reps. Um, you see, I'm going kind of, it's not super heavy, but enough where when I'm, by the time I'm failing, I'm using just a tad bit of momentum, but it's killer arm workout. There we go. I just feel the burn just watching it. Um, and next I hear hop right into triceps after. Um, and then for triceps, it's, it's super simple. I start with um, just an overhead easy bar extension. I did four warm up sets with only like 60 pounds. And then I did work the first two working sets with 100 and then 110s. Uh, I think I have 100 here. I'm shooting for 14 to 18 reps. Um, and this next one is just a straight cable push down. Uh, like I said, it's a very simple workout, very short commentary, the shortest one of your life but I keep it really simple right now. I'm in prep, eight weeks out, you know, I'm just going through the motions, 14 to 18 reps, almost every workout. But enjoy the rest of the video, guys. If you have any questions about my workouts, my splits, drop them down in the comments. Okay, guys, I got a shipment in today from uh, one of my sponsors, Caged Muscle. Um, it's like some of my monthly stuff. Some months I need other things that I wouldn't need a month before because things run out before others. Um, but I have this. I have three more packages coming in. I am sponsored by Jed North and I have a package coming from them. And I bought a pair of shoes from Nike. And what else do I have? I have something else coming in. I'll think of it. And I order from Dark Sport. The order from Dark Sport, though, I bought. I didn't, I'm not a sponsor by them. Okay. So every month, I get two containers of isolate protein. I use isolate year-round prep, off-season. I always use isolate. Um, it digests really, really easily. And when you shake it up, it's not, um, like, chalky or thick or anything like that. Um, I only I get two every month because I'm right now I'm taking, like, four scoops of protein almost a day to post-workout and then about two before I go to bed. So it's quite a bit of protein. And right now I'm on, counting my post-workout shake and banana, eight meals a day. The flavors I got, cinnamon, French toast, and chocolate. And I have um, chocolate peanut butter upstairs, or s'mores upstairs. Chocolate is probably my favorite though. I have pre-workout. I always get, um, they have like cage sport. I always get um, pre-caged. It's more of like a full blown pre-workout because I've am i been taking it for years. So I kind of have like a tolerance, even though I cycle off of it. Um, I still have somewhat of a tolerance. I've been taking it straight for probably like three, three and a half months. Um, and I have fermented BCAAs, just a standard two one one ratio, 36 servings in it. I unflavored, I'll just throw it in like my shake or in the morning. I take it, um, yeah, I take it three times a day, actually. I take it in the morning before breakfast. I take it pre-workout and I take it post-workout. Well, in the pre-caged, it's not a lot of caffeine, but it has a lot of other ingredients that is for the pump. They have a muscle fuel matrix, anabolic activator, strength and power matrix, and they have um, coconut water powder in here just like electrolytes, or like to keep you hydrated. So there's a lot of stuff in here. I got some uh, caged swag. Can't go wrong with another snapback. And 
It's like for the 4th of July, they came out with another line. Or not, not necessarily a line, just like some products exclusive for 4th of July, or like Patriot. This is the Patriot tea. And I got fish oil, creatine hydrochloride, and multivitamin. I could have gotten more stuff. I didn't even reach my limit. Um, but I have like so much supplements. Though I obviously take supplements besides this. Besides this, I'll take like a vitamin C, vitamin D3, uh, turmeric, curcumin, um, citrus bergamot, choline, and Uh I think that is it. And N acetylcysteine. Besides like my amino acids, multivitamin fish oil, those are the uh, supplements that I take. But yeah, nothing too crazy. Um, just some of the supplements that I'll take in a month. Really, they come in clutch though. Like if I need something, if I want like a probiotic or they have a new sleep supplement, like if I message them, um, they're just like, okay, no problem. Like they send it right to me, no questions asked. So, you know, go check them out. I'll put a link down below. Um, use code Brady. If you buy anything, it'll save you some money, help me out. But yeah, that's it, nothing too exciting. Um, feel me a little out of order. It's um, the 9th, it's the evening. I unboxed my cage muscle supplements yesterday and I just got home from the gym. I have a package here from Jed North and I bought something from the new Dark Sport launch. Um, I just got a tank top and I got Joanne a cropped hoodie. So yeah, nothing crazy. Um, I'm sponsored by Jed North, I'm also sponsored by Cage Muscle. Um, it's like the first week of the month, today's the 9th, so the packages are just now getting here. So I'll take you through it. Let's go ahead and open the dark sport first. I just got a tank. Um, their stuff, I feel like their sizing is a little inconsistent, so I was hesitant, but I got an XL. Let's take this. Oh, it's not like a cotton, it's like a performance material. So let's give this a try. Mm -hmm. mm -hmm. Okay, here is an XL. Just says dark sport. It's like a performance material. It's definitely four-way stretch. It's sweat wicking uh, versus all the stuff I have them from them now is like a cotton is the base. And on the back it just says um, like dark sport bodybuilding club uh, NFGU, which stands for never fucking give up. So it's a pretty sweet shirt. Uh, it's an XL at two X would have definitely been too long, but their stuff is made for oversized for the most part. Some of their stuff runs a little small. That's why I'm like. And it's, sizing is a little inconsistent. Um, let's find some Jed North. So before I open this stuff, um, I wear only for bottoms, Lululemon or Gymshark. Not because, you know, the other ones are, you know, they're bad or anything, but those are the ones that are my favorite, that have fit the best. Um, I worked for Lululemon for three years, so I have like everything. These are um, THE seven inch linerless. I have probably like at least 10, 15 pairs of these, different colors. They're my favorite. All of, so that that being said, everything that I have here is tops, either tank tops, stringers, shirts, or hoodies. Jed North, I like you, but your sizing is consistent too. So I just got, this is just a plain sleeveless shirt. It says lift. I don't know what size, it's an XL. So I'll show you guys something It's going to blow your mind. This is an XL and then I have this is a 3X. So watch, they're going to fit Whoa. about the same probably. Like anytime you go to Jed North, always look at the size chart because I think they have different manufacturers that make different shirts and materials and that's why they're like so different. To be completely honest, I'm not a huge fan of shirts like this. I prefer tanks. Um, but I saw this, you know, it's sleeveless. I'm like, yeah, I'll try it out because it, it covers the traps. I like, you know, I think most people nowadays, they like the tanks more. This, this has like the dad vibe, which is okay, but it's not my, uh, not my jam. But it's a nice shirt. It's super soft, four-way stretch. Um, it's not like a performance material. It's more of like a cotton base, but it's a really nice shirt. Next, I, I got two of these hoodies. I have so many hoodies, but these are pretty new. So... I was like, eh, you know what? Let me just get two hoodies. You can't have too many hoodies. Because when I do cardio in the mornings, I always wear a hoodie to do cardio in. I guess I could have left the shirt on while I put the hoodie on. Okay, so this is a large. 
It's over. It's oversized though. That's why I got it at a large because I, I didn't want it to be massive. So not bad. It's kind of it's kind of thick. Definitely warmer than I anticipated, but it's a nice hoodie. I'll definitely get a lot of use out of it. This is the exact same hoodie. It's oversized too, but the size chart on these is massive because a size large is like 50 inch chest. Then a 2X is like a size 60 chest. 60 plus probably to be honest. Yeah, this one, I actually kind of like this one better. This is nice. I can't say I own anything that's this color. This one has different packaging too. Okay, so this is a tank. I have a few tanks like this. It's really just a basic tank. This is super light. Like this shirt weighs merely ounces. This is an XL. So it, it fits honestly perfect probably. So now I'm gonna try on th the 3X, this t-shirt. It says do the work. So you've seen me try a large, an XL, and now you'll see me try on a 3X. This is a 3X, but like look at the fit in the shoulders in the back. I ordered a 2X last month, and like I couldn't even get it on over my back. It's, it's mad long, but it can be hemmed up. I don't know if you guys can see how long it is, but it can be hemmed for like 10 bucks, so not a big deal. But just a nice basic tee over. It's not supposed to be an oversized fit, but like this size chart again, it's so different versus everything else that like the only way I could fit into it is getting the 3X. This one is the same shirt as that, but it, nothing on the front on the back it just says sacrifice I don't know if you guys can see that yeah it's the same it's the back so you guys can see it it's really long but as far as like the fit and the shoulders in the back I couldn't get a smaller size that's the struggle <laughs> perfect fit I really like the make of these. This, this is my favorite stringer. Well, all of the stringers on their website, they have so many styles. This one is the favorite as far as the fit, the material. It's super soft. It kind of reminds me of like uh, French Terry. But yeah, it's my favorite. As far as the clothes, um, this is all. You know, I just had the Cajun Muscle last night. I had the Jed North come in today. The Dark Sport came in today. And I have some shoes coming in on uh, Monday. I probably won't show them. But yeah, I have shipments come in every month. I like to shop, you know, I get things. And yeah, Jed North, they hooked me up. If you guys want anything, like I said, this is my favorite, this tank, all the name of it. These are my some of my favorite staples. I wear them to train. These I always wear around the house. Um, but yeah, if you guys want anything, you know, I'll put the link below. Okay guys, I'm gonna wrap up the video here. I hope you like the arm day. I hope you like the unboxing. Um, one last thing, these shirts, they're made right here. Um, Joanne, my girlfriend, she has an Etsy shop, Lasting Intent, custom. They're not available yet, but you can get them, you can get whatever size you want. This one is 2X, it's oversized, right around the house. It looks good with some jeans. Flip around. But yeah, it's just a nice swaggy shirt. You know, it's comparable to going along the line of like Stussy, Billionaire Boys Club, if you guys like brands like that, but just hipster, you know, streetwear. But yeah, guys, don't forget to like, comment, subscribe if you guys like the video. Uh, the link to uh, get to the shop will be below. And yeah, guys, stay tuned for the next video. Peace out.